Hello friends, Namaste Dosto. This restaurant in India is so popular that even Shah Rukh Khan has eaten here and also Amir Khan because that is... It is Tunde Kebabi in Lucknow, India. This is the original one. You can see they have chicken going. They have all kinds of flatbread. Shirmal. This is this is paratha, Mughlai paratha. Okay. And this is this is the most popular part. They have the kebabs, mutton mutton kebabs. Yeah, mutton kebabs. And they have more kebabs over here. Hi everybody. Hi. Okay. So we're, you can see there's there's tons of people here. I'm gonna try to get a seat inside. I don't know if it's possible. But yeah, I want to show you Shah Rukh Khan right now, his photo, not him actually. But let's go inside. Oh my goodness. I can't even. There's so many people. Okay, you can see they're all making the food. They have like, that's like a takeaway. Now look at this. Look, you're not gonna believe this. There he is. Shah Rukh Khan has been here. There's his name, Shah Rukh Khan. And look. Amir Khan So many so many Salman Khan So many different actors Ranbir Kapoor Everyone I mean like all the famous people have been here. All right, let's see if I can even get in here I don't know. I think it's like so full Okay all right, here we go. I made it. There's so so many people in here. I don't even know where to sit. I guess we'll sit over here. Over here? Okay. Thank you. Look at that. I actually got a seat. Is there a menu? I'm amazed I actually got a seat. Okay, thank you. All right, the thing to get here is mutton kebab. So, let's see here. Two mutton kebabs. Two pieces or two plates. One plate has four pieces, so how many plates do you want? I just want, I just want two pieces. Only two pieces, okay. And then one, one shirma okay. and one mughlai paratha. That's all. Anything to drink? Wow, that was easy. Man, I'm so lucky. You saw how many people are in here. Okay. Oh man, I don't think people want to be on the video. Okay. So I thought it was going to take a long time, so I turned off my uh, action camera because I thought it was going to take a while, and then they came right away. So here we go. This is the Mughlai Paratha. <coughs> This is called a sheer mall. This is my first time ever having a sheer mall. And then this is the kebabs. I know it doesn't look like much, but kebabs can be a lot of food. <clears throat> so this is mutton kebabs. These are some of the most famous kebabs in all of India. And I'm about to try it out right now. So here, actually, yeah, this, I mean, oh my goodness, wow. Just tearing that off was so easy. This, even this is gonna be amazing. Okay, let's try. I'm gonna show you what it looks like. See, look at that, look at that. That is like really tender. They just, they blend it up. Nobody knows like the real recipe. So here we go. Yeah, absolutely amazing. It is really, really tender, really, really soft. Mutton kebab. I, I've had I've had other kebabs here in Lucknow, and these are by far the best. That no one knows the recipe. This is like the place to come. It's very good. It's amazing. Yeah. Uh, USA, America, yeah. United States. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
I mean, maybe I should have gotten more. Actually, the kebab's a little bit smaller than I remember. Mm. But yeah, that paratha. Even the paratha is just really something special. It, it itself is just very, like, very soft. So this mutton is, like I said, is very soft, but it has a little bit of crispiness on the outside also. All right, now we're gonna try the shirmal. I've never had shirmal before. I don't, I don't even really know what it is. Yeah, it's like this orange. It's like this orange thing, I, I don't know. Oh. It's really good too, I didn't do my homework before I came to see what, what it is actually. Yeah, it's really good too. I, they, they give you lime, but I, I just don't want to put lime on it. It's, it's already good enough. Oh my goodness. Mm. So good. Mm. Best kebab in India, for sure. I mean, you see all the people here. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't know what I like better, the shimal or the Mughalai Parata. Man, I, I probably could have eaten more. But I think that's enough. We have a lot of bread here still that I'm, I'm gonna eat no matter what. Okay, those kebabs were actually absolutely amazing. I highly recommend anyone go to Tunde Kebabi in Lucknow. But now we gotta get some sweets. We got some sweets here. Look at that. Hey, Marty, hey, hey, Marty. Hey, Marty, 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 hey, Wow. Okay. Can we have one more? Yes, one more. One more. One more. I've never had these sweets. Well, this is a big jalebi. It looks different though. I've never had this before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay. America say. Ohio. Ohio. California. Ah, nice. Okay. All right. So, hey, 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 hey. Samosa. Cindy. Cindy samosa. Okay. This is a Cindy samosa. I can do it like this, actually. They get some sun in here. There we go. Cindy, Cindy samosa. Okay. I've never, I've never had this before. Indian culture of Cindy samosa. Okay, Cindy samosa. Here we go. First time trying Cindy samosa ever. Oh. Oh, very good. Yeah, yeah, sweet, yeah. For Sunday. So he called this a samosa. It's a very different looking kind of samosa. Wow, it's very crunchy. It's very sweet, it's like glazed. You see these layers. There's like layers of um, flakiness, I guess. It really, 
It's really big though. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to eat the whole thing. We'll see how it goes. Mm. Oh, there's, there's something else in here. I'm not really sure what that is. Something red. Oh, it's really sweet. Well, oh. um, I, I am liking the crunchiness. I like it with how sweet it is. Man, I think some people would think this might be a little bit too sweet. This is really good. I think I would like this a lot better if it was a lot smaller. This is way too big. I think there's a lot of like honey in it. It was glazed with um, something really sweet also. I don't know what was in the middle there though. Wow, there's so many people here. So many people. Alright, I I gotta try one of these. Kasak Tamu Ek? Alright, I'm gonna try it. This is like a jelly bee. A jelly bee? This is like a jelly bee, but hey, we're in luck now. So this might even be better than a regular jelly bee. I mean, it looks really different, right? It's like... I mean, this is huge. Look at that. This big giant orange thing. Let's see, let's see how it tastes compared to like a regular jelly bee. It tastes, it tastes like, it tastes pretty similar to a normal jalebi. I kind of like, I like how they made it though. Just like the texture and how it tastes. I think I kind of like it better this way actually. Man, once again, this jalebi is really sweet also. All right, I don't think. I don't think I can I can eat this entire thing though. Here in luck now, everything is just a lot bigger. It seems like. All right now, mm, yeah. This was actually a little bit chewy. I like the chewiness here. Very crunchy and chewy at the same time. I kind of like that combination. Now, this is how they make it. got like this orange <laughs> this orange paste you put it you fry it in oil you wait a while and just take it out that simple okay now it now I said at the beginning it tastes like a regular jalebi but now it's changed a little bit now it's like getting a little bit more chewy it's really good though all right I think this is better than just like a normal jalebi Okay, I'm at this uh, the Sahara Mall in Lucknow, and the, at this mall they also have a tunde kebabi. So I decided I wanted to see if their tunde kebabi here tastes like the original, and I got some of their chicken biryani. So first we're gonna see if this tastes like the original. Already the kebabs look a little bit bigger. Mm. Yeah, it's still very good. The spices taste a tad bit different though. But it's still it's still very very good.
the I got the Mughlai Paratha. It's still better than any other kebabs I've ever had in India. And there's way less people here. I mean, I know people want to eat at the original, but there's so many people there, it's almost not worth it. It was easy, there, we were the only ones in line here at the mall. Okay, now I'm gonna try some of the, the, the biryani. They gave me some raita. Here, I'll let. They give me some raita. This is the biryani, you got rice and chicken. So Lucknow is famous for their biryani. Put a little bit of more right down. All right, first, first we're just gonna try to eat the rice itself. Wow, man, I've never had, that's like the best rice I've ever had. That was, that, that just had a, a punch of flavors. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I don't know what they put in here. All right, so now, okay, pretty decent size of chicken. Sorry. Wow, the chicken is really tender. Just melt in your mouth. That's, that's like their motto, melt in your mouth kebabs. And I would say the chicken is also very melt in your mouth. Now I know there's probably better chicken biryani here in Lucknow, but I wanted to at least try theirs first. Because they're so famous for their kebabs. I figured we'd try their chicken biryani. But man, that rice. Wow, yeah. I would say already that rice is absolutely amazing. I mean, just tons and tons of flavor. I've never had such flavorful rice before. Chicken is very tender also, but man, I think, I think for the first time ever in my life, I actually like the rice better than the chicken. I've never said that in my entire life before. All right, so my conclusion is that the Mughalai Paratha and the kebabs taste very similar to the original. The, for some reason, the spices taste a little bit different and the kebabs are a little bit bigger. And the chicken biryani is amazing. But I definitely want to see what else they offer here in Lucknow. What other kind of chicken biryani can I get? So keep watching my videos here in Lucknow and see what I think about their other food. Bye bye, Dosto.